I left school at 18 um, and I actually started in the tax office. I enjoy the challenge of tax, I enjoy the problem solving. I'm a black woman to help not just my clients, even my friends. A lot of international tax dealing with different jurisdictions keeps the work varied and interesting. I work in uh, corporate and managed investment trusts for our larger corporate clients in our firm. The world changes, uh, there are new paradigms to, to have to deal with. Uh, the tax system is becoming so complex and so challenging. I think if you're serious about a career in tax, it's really just a no-brainer. The great thing about the CTA is it's a very broad-based professional qualification, so it covers uh, all aspects of tax. Well, what experience do you have in tax? Well, I'm actually a CTA. Oh, you're a CTA, yeah. It is a tough qualification to get. It's a slog. And you know that if someone's demonstrated that level of dedication to their profession, then you know that at the end of it, they're going to know what they're talking about. And because there is that benchmark that's set by the CCA, I think it's great for employers because it allows them to get an idea of someone's capabilities. I'm in an international network, uh, and to me it's important to be able to talk to international clients. It gives me professional confidence that when I'm providing advice to somebody, um, it's underpinned with a solid knowledge of the tax law. It just broadens my career path so that my skills can basically take me everywhere, anywhere around the world, and I can be employed. I mean, one of the great things with the CTA is the recognition. It's certainly been easier to be recognised amongst corporates and clients. You wouldn't want someone doing brain surgery on you if they hadn't spent some time learning a bit about it. And you probably wouldn't want an amateur doing your tax affairs on it. Especially at that higher level, I mean, it's very challenging, but I also think it's very rewarding. I have no limit. Who knows where I can be?